Here we are going to study how to draw a cam profile with roller follower having an offset. Okay. So the follower diagram is already drawn here. So these are the given parameter. The follower type the follower type is roller follower. The follower type is roller follower. Minimum radius of the cam is 25. Drift is given as 30. Roll diameter is 15 mm and the follower motion is given. Speed of the cam is 150 mm and there is an offset distance of 10 mm. Okay, and this is the follower displacement. The rise is for 150 degree using constant acceleration and deceleration, then followed by dwell for 30 degree, then return using SHM for 60 so for 120 degree and dwell at minimum rest of the 60 degree. Okay, so going to the cam profile. First, you have to draw a starting from here first you have to draw a base circle of radius r equal to 25 mm okay so base circle radius is given in the question now you have to draw another circle concentric to base circle it is called prime circle and the radius of prime circle will be equal to base circle radius plus roller radius here in the given parameter the roller diameter is given as 15 mm that is the roller type is and the follower type is roller and the diameter of, of the roller is 15 mm so radius of the roller will be 7.5 mm so base circle radius plus 7.5 it will be 32.5 so you have to draw a circle concentric to base circle at a radius of 32.5 and it will be called as prime circle now you have now an offset distance is given offset distance is 10 mm to the left so you have to draw an offset distance from the center that is 10 mm. Okay. So I have drawn a line and the length of the line is you can see it's 10 mm to the left. So I have drawn to the left from the center to the left. Now I have to draw a circle which center as the center of the base circle and radius as 10 that is the offset distance. And that circle is called as offset circle. Okay. Offset circle. Uh, the offset distance mean, mean that the follower is lying 10 mm to the left of the uh, 10 mm to the left from the center of cam. Now you have to draw a follower. So I have drawn a follower. Follower means I have already taught you have to draw a line from the end of this 10 mm vertical. And this line will be the center line of the follower. You have to mark it like this. Okay. Then you have to draw the follower. So here diameter of the roller will be here diameter of the roller will be 50. That is the diameter of the roller given in the question. Okay. So you have to draw a roller that will be the, just touching the base circle. The roller will be just touching the base circle. You can see here. Okay. After drawing the roller, you have to start partitioning. Okay, uh, here the uh, offset is on the left side, so you have to partition through the right side or in the clockwise direction. For starting the partition, you have to connect the center of the base circle to the trace point of the follower. Okay, so that here the trace point of the follower will be the center of the roller. So I have connected a line from the center of the base circle to the center of the roller. Now you have to give the partition. So here the partition is 150, 30, 120 and 60. So I have made the partition here. So I have made the partition from here. Here it's 150 degree followed by 30 then 120 and 60. Okay. Now based on the follower diagram you have to make the partition for the rise and the return that is 150 degree and 120 degree. 30 and 60 are 12. So there we, no, we need not draw the partition. So 150 here, 150 is divided into 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6 partition and 120 is divided into 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6 partition. So I have divided this 150 into 6 partition and I have made the number 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and this 120 also into 6 partition. So the last number will be 30. Okay. 
last number will be 30 so the 150 is ending at 6 120 starting from 7 and ending at 30 you can check here 150 is ending at 6 120 is starting from 7 and ending at 30 after that after that from each point you have to construct tangent from 1 I am constructing a tangent to the offset circle from 2 I am constructing a tangent to the offset circle similar uh, likewise you have to connect a, a tangent from all the points okay you can extend it okay you can extend it okay so here the figure I have connected the tangents from all points that is 1 to 13 to the offset circle now you have to uh, take the dimensions from the displacement diagram and mark it on the line of the tangent okay outside the prime circle so this is our prime circle the outside circle is prime circle so we are ma making all our marking on the prime circle okay the use of base circle is only at the last okay so you can see i have made all the uh, marking for example 44 dash is 23.33 9, 9 dash is 22.5 so I have made the marking you can use a compass and mark the lines okay after that construct a curve passing through the dash points okay that is 1 dash 2 dash 3 dash construct a curve passing through the dash points okay I have constructed the curve and the curve ended at 13 so you have to continue from 13 to 0 also so I have continued from 13 to 0 so this uh, curve is called as pitch curve pitch curve pitch curve means the curve that trace uh, the curve passing through the locus of the trace point the curve passing through the locus of the trace point that is the curve passing through the center of the roller this is called as pitch curve so we have drawn the pitch curve okay. after that you have to <coughs> after that you know the radius of the roller that is 50 uh, sorry radius is 7.5 diameter is 50 you have to uh, construct at all dash points the roller okay so i am drawing a roller of diameter 50 or radius similar likewise i am doing it in all dash points in case <coughs> it's difficult to draw a row, draw a circle at that point because the radius is so minimum at least you have to draw an arc okay so i am giving an arc of uh, radius 7.5 then i am drawing an arc at least you have to draw an arc like this okay or draw a roller which is uh, which is easy for you so i have drawn an arc here so I have made this in 4 dash I have drawn an arc either you can draw a full circle or an arc but arc is uh, any uh, one of this is mandatory okay after drawing this you have to connect a smooth curve passing through the base of the, all the rollers so I am constructing here the curve so I have started one point second point I am taking is this third point I am taking is this if I am selecting uh, if I am selecting another point like this I am selecting the intersection point you can see here the intersection point the curve will pass over the roller which cannot be possible here you can see the curve is passing over the roller after one after two also the curve is passing over, over the roller that cannot be possible so you have to construct a beautiful curve that is passing through the base of the roller like this 2 dash 3 dash likewise okay so i have made the construction here so i have made a curve passing just below the base circle okay i will show one mistake here i have made a mistake the curve is passing through the roller that cannot be possible you have to construct a smooth curve passing through the base of the roller okay after constructing the the, curve, the profile is not complete it should be complete only when you join this line also so i made the 
join have joined the base of them. Okay. So this will be the final diagram. Okay. Thank you.